Hey guys, it's Filmer. Um, I got another Halo 4 SWAT video for you. Sound abandoned. It's the point of view of um, Death Hero. But he's actually using uh, his second account, Ill Viral. And uh, he's playing with Odacity, Death Kane, IBR Famous, and uh, they're playing against the blue team, which is uh, Main SK, B Hyphy, uh, Hey Donnie, which is uh, E Frame, and uh, Abrupt. And uh, this is a uh, older video, as you can tell. Uh, three four three fucked up the spawns for SWAT. Um, I guess uh, they've they've added some improvements, but I would just say it's fucking retarded. Um, but whatever. I mean, I guess it's closer to Team Throwdown, which I kind of understand that. But at first, I was kind of pissed. Because, like, now, killing errors are, like, five times fucking harder to get. And they were pretty easy, but now they're just ridiculous. Um, kiss your fucking killing errors goodbye, uh, montage kids. Because, uh, you're not getting it in fucking SWAT anymore. It, like, if you ever gone to Haven, Haven spawns you on the correct sides for your, you know, depending on your color, uh, of your team. Which makes sense, I understand that, but I really, like, the fact that blue team could spawn bottom uh, um, bottom open and uh, red team spawns that uh, ramp mohawk. I really did like that. It was more of a challenge because red team kind of have like a little better setup. Same with abandoned. As we're looking at abandoned right now, red team spawns on the bottom of uh, of uh, top gold. It's not top gold, but you know bottom where the crates are. Right where Ed is right now. And, uh, that's fucking retarded, but still, like, I mean, it doesn't matter, I can still get to ring 3 pretty quick, pretty fast, too. The, pretty much, they changed the spawns, and then they added a block right outside of ring 2 on that blue platform. Which, I mean, it's easy, but that's great, that's a, another easy way to get the, um, ring 3. I'm, I know tryhards are definitely gonna know, uh, what to do with that, but random kids and kids that don't really play that much are not gonna really know like that you can get from ring three from there unless they're completely retarded I don't know it depends on uh, depends on the player but anyways uh, like I've, I've talked a lot about um, people's gameplays and I always rant on about stuff but I mean for somebody that does commentaries like me my commentaries are okay but uh I definitely really think that uh, most people should be looking at uh, most of the gameplay I post up because I do have uh, some of the best SWAT players uh, play SWAT in front of you guys with a good game, good commentary, and I'm, I'm not like, I'm not a tool. Like, I'm not that fucking shitty player or that fucking shitty kid or that dude who just rants about the stupidest shit. I actually have a pretty cool personality, um, I'm not like one of those fucking weirdos on YouTube who have like 30,000 subscribers that just suck, um, those people suck anyways, anyways, um, yeah, like, if you're playing SWAT and you, and you love SWAT, like, this, this goes for all the people that don't really know who I am, um, you should definitely check a these videos out because these guys are like the top players for SWAT. I mean, people say that SWAT takes like no skill, but like, I mean, come on, like, I've played many Slayer kids that are pretty good as Slayer, but as soon as they come in a SWAT, they get destroyed because they still think they got their full shields and they don't have that mentality like a SWAT player has. They don't have their uh, map awareness as much as a SWAT player. I feel like a SWAT player has more map map awareness than a true slayer player depending on the map though if it's a swap map the uh, swap player is definitely going to know the map inside out better than a slayer kid uh, but i feel like <clears throat> some slayer kids are good and some slayer kids are pretty bad at their map awareness and that's that's definitely a key for every playlist for every thing that you play in halo is definitely map awareness you got to have that map awareness if you don't, then you're just gonna be like, you know, sucking all the time. 
I mean, this is uh, this is the second game of that Haven game that Death Hero um, was playing with uh, with his team that he's playing with now and uh, playing against the dudes that are very good. Not not one person in this game is bad. It, they're all good. They all have their good and bad games. Uh, that's gonna happen with people that are very good. Uh, they're not. They're not always gonna be on point. I would like to say that some of these guys are the majority of the time on point when they play, but I mean, you gotta give them warm-up time. Can't just go straight into a game and expect shit like this, but you know, this shit is really good, and I hope you guys enjoy that. I hope I'm not ranting too much. <laughs> enjoy that shit, guys. Learn from it. Learn, watch, do whatever. Later, guys.